Hey everyone, it's me, Tiffany, and today I'm doing a quick flip through of Stardust and Space Lust by Carla Magana. If you haven't checked her out yet, definitely you should do so by going to her YouTube channel. It's under Carla Magana, as is her uh, Instagram, which she posts to regularly. Um, this book, as you can see, is very space theme inspired, hence the title. And I really love her line work and just her character design. It's so fun and angular yet soft at moments, I suppose. And one of the things Carla always suggests is that you color outside the lines. Um, if you watch some of her videos, you'll see her add circles to her pages or other lines to add more dimension to the page. Um, and I really like that she encourages us to do so. I don't know if you can tell these disco ball inspired circles there. Carla definitely has a thing for the late 70s, early 80s, if I remember correctly. And her art is very much inspired by those time frames. So, this book has been out for a little bit. I was late in getting it. Just uh, got it recently and wanted to do a quick flip through for everyone. This page, I love this page. It reminds me of the Jetsons. <laughs> And if you don't know what the Jetsons are, it's this cartoon back in the day, or my day, I suppose. Um, it was a fun family cartoon, or family friendly, kid friendly. Anyway, this page kind of also uh, reminds me of Gem and the Holograms, which would go back to her inspiration being the late 70s and the early 80s. And here she's included a couple of test pages, which I absolutely love. You can check out your material and make sure they work on her paper. And the last page has uh, her other books, Spooky Sweets, Dark Garden, Desert Muse, and Wee Wickeds. I still need to get my hands on Desert Muse. And a couple more blank pages. And then at the end, just a nice little image with the her words color outside the lines. So, anyways, I hope you all enjoyed this quick flip through. Thank you for stopping by and have a wonderfully blessed day.